Like I said in my last video, I am going to be spending every last penny I have on Fortnite. Oh, oh shit. Thank you. Yes, dude. This video did so well. 408 likes. That's the most I've ever got on a single video. Yeah. Go ahead and buy that. So we're going to go ahead and buy this. So over the past few years, the main focus of my channel has been Fortnite spending sprees. This video is my 35th spending spree, and I regret to tell you that it's going to be the last one. Of chapter 3, because we're going into chapter 4, baby! Woo! That's right, you just got jabated. I'm not stopping spending sprees until I buy everything, so rest assured. Alright, we got some new FNCS goodies here. And honestly, I think these are by far the coolest FNCS skins we've gotten. Absolutely worth it. Then we also got this Akatsuki wrap. Never got the chance to get this, but it's finally back, so I'm gonna buy it. And then I, with this last 200 V-Bucks, I guess I'll buy this. All right, so we got this Arctic Command bundle here. I could get a skin and a glider for 300 V-Bucks. That seems like a pretty good deal to me. Then coming down here, we got Chaos Agent. This is a really clean skin. I like how slim it is. It's also got this really cool edit style here. Overall, pretty good skin. Also got the wrap to go along with it. Super clean. This wrap would also go pretty good with Venom. Then coming down here, we got Hayseed, which is, uh, it's a uh, okay skin. Pretty good, I guess. I mean, if I'm being honest, I don't think I'll use it all that much, if ever, but it's not bad for an 800 V-Bucks skin. Then we got this Terminus glider. I always thought this glider was pretty clean, just a little bulky. Probably not worth 1,200, but it is what it is. Then we got this Fortnited emote. I honestly don't remember this coming out, but seems like a cool emote. Only 300. Also got this Uncharted bundle here, and the only thing I don't have is the glider for 100 V-Bucks. Pretty dope glider too. Definitely a bulky one, but still cool. Then we got this uh, Rats Attack. This looks fucking stupid. The back bling's all right, uh, pickaxe. Definitely unique. The wrap is kind of just another wrap, nothing special. And then it's got this loading screen and... Why? Just why? My fucking day is ruined now. Now I'm gonna proceed to buy it anyway, just so I could show you all what not to do with your money. We got this Underland Nexus bundle. There's kind of too much going on here for me, if I'm being honest. I can say with 100% certainty, I probably won't ever equip this skin, but not as bad as the last one. Not really a super great shop today, honestly. Then I'm gonna buy some tiers because I actually didn't buy any tiers this season. It was the first season I didn't buy to tier 100 since chapter two, season two. I'm only level 73 right now, so I kinda gotta get a little boost. And I guess I may as well just finish it off. All right, so starting off in this shop, we got a couple icon emotes here that I don't already have. We also got the lazy shuffle. I always thought this emote was kind of dog shit. I never really liked it. The music is ass and emote itself, it's just not great. But of course I'm gonna buy it anyway, cause I buy everything. And then we got this new Maya He emote, so... This is a respectable icon emote. It's a classic meme. Of course, I'm gonna buy it. Then we got this Glum Bunny skin here. Uh, I really don't think I'll ever equip this. I guess it's not bad for what it is, but I really don't think I'll use it. 
then coming down here we got this prismatic pride bundle I think this is a pretty cool skin. It's got some edit styles, or just one edit style. Both edit styles look super clean though. Pretty good bundle here. Then coming down here, we got Armadillo. It's a very clean skin. I think it's great for the price. The only thing I wish is that they put like an army helmet or something instead of the goofy mohawk. But for what it is, I can't really complain. Only 800 V-Bucks. Although it would be cool if they added an edit style in the future. Then we got Stingray. Pretty cool. I like the detail on this skin. Then coming over here, we got Switch Step. This is a certified hood classic of an emote, so definitely gonna be buying that. Then we got Jumping Jacks. It's a good bang for your buck emote. And then we got this Assassin's Creed stuff. This is actually really cool to see. I, I never got the chance to buy these when they first came out. Great price too. It's times like these that I wish I never took up the task of trying to buy every skin in the game. Because uh, here Epic goes and drops like, what, what is this, 10 new skins and none of them are in a bundle. So I have to buy all of them individually and this is 15,000 V-Bucks worth of skins that I know I will never wear. Okay, well I, I might wear them sometimes, but I'm not even a fan of soccer, dude. I, I really, if I wear these, it'll be once or twice. Well, here goes nothing, I guess. Just gonna casually buy 15,000 V-Bucks of skins that I'm never gonna use. <laughs> no no big deal here. Nothing, nothing interesting to see. Uh, oh man, this is not fun. I can tell you that much. <laughs> Why am I doing this? Uh, there, <laughs> there is so, so, so much better things I could buy right now. Coming down here too, we got the gear bundle. And of course they put the gear in a bundle, but they can't put the f***ing skins in a bundle. Anyway, it's got this trophy, pretty cool. Pickaxe is cool. Yep, they're very awesome. Nice. And then we got these, just more stuff I'm never gonna use. It just sucks because I have most of the good skins at the point in this game, so at this point everything I buy is, is, is like stuff I'm not gonna use. I have just about every skin I'd ever want. At this point, I'm just I'm cleaning up the crumbs. So we got this guy. Uh, yeah, it's it's a it's a skin. Just another skin I'm not gonna use, honestly. And then we got this skin, which is, it's an okay skin, I guess. Probably won't use it still. And, uh, these, yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna use those. Uh, the glider is realistically probably the best thing here, just because of how silly it looks. Yeah, the glider is actually kind of cool. I like that cool wing flapping animation. Then we got Tango right here. Not much to say, it's just a pretty clean skin fairly basic. I do like how, it, how it's got the pink vest though. It's a nice contrast to the rest of the skin. I could see myself using this once in a while. Then we also got the agile edge pickaxes here, which are actually pretty clean. I like the sounds too. Nice. All right, so today is actually Thanksgiving when I'm recording this. When you're watching it, it's probably not, unless you happen to be watching it on Thanksgiving in the future. But anyway, I just wanted to say happy Thanksgiving, and I'm thankful for all of you watching the channel, supporting me. I really appreciate it. I feel like I don't say that enough, but I really do appreciate all of you. So starting off today, we got Patrick Mahomes. Uh, I don't watch football, so I don't really know much about all this, but... Comes with two skins here. Got a few styles on here. It looks like it progressively upgrades the armor. And then we also got the second skin here, which I, I think I like this one a little more. He's got, got some good drip on here. Pretty good stuff. I'd probably appreciate it a lot more if I was a fan of football, but um, not bad. 
And then we got this, and the only thing I don't have here is... Also got the Storm Racer here, which is the male version of Pit Stop. Probably just another skin that's gonna sit there, but you never know, I might use it. And the pickaxe, which is actually pretty clean, and it has styles to go with the skins that it styles. Pretty cool. Also got this sledge skin here, which is just like a bulky juggernaut. That second style is pretty much a different skin, so 1200 that's a good price. And the pickaxe to go along with it. Then we got Flap Jackie, another skin I could safely say I probably won't use. I, I know I won't use it. I, I know for a fact. And the, wow, that's this has got to be one of the ugliest pickaxes in the game. Again, something I'm probably not going to use. And then also the glider, which is, uh, it's alright. Yeah, not really a fan of this whole set, honestly. Then we got this little mower emote. I honestly can't get enough of the, the traversal vehicle emotes. They're, they're always great. So you already know I'm gonna buy it. And the mainframe glider. Alright, we got this machine learning bundle. They have some styles. Okay, so they seem to be super customizable. You could use wraps, that's cool. Alright, I'm down with more wrap skins, and honestly, these look a lot cooler than the other wrap skins. So that's cool, and don't tell me. Alright, that's just, that's, this is, this is some of the coolest shit we've gotten in a long time, that's all I gotta say. Really good, really good. And we got some new wraps down here. Really nice. I like that. That one's super dope too. Another really cool one. That's a, uh, from last season, I guess. I must have missed it. Yeah, dang. I've never seen a lot of these. Must have just missed them, and then they hardly came out. And there's even more down here. Wow. I had no idea how many wraps I was missing. I thought I actually had a good chunk of them, but I guess I guess I'm wrong. Um, yeah, I don't really have anything to say. I mean, most of these are pretty cool. This one's eh. That one's all right. Yeah, damn, I thought- I thought of, like, all the cosmetics, I was probably the closest to owning all the wraps. But, um, here we are. I- I wonder how close I'll be after this. Probably a lot closer than before. And then we got Peekaboo. Classic skin here, you know, not much to say. It's, uh, just... You know, kind of, kind of goofy, silly, fun skin. Uh, I don't hate it. I don't love it. I, I might wear it once in a while. Don't really have anything else to say. But there's Peekaboo, and also got the axe or size. Not a pickaxe I could see myself using. It's just not, not very aesthetically pleasing to me. The shape of it and all that. The shop just reset, and we got something that's kind of rare, I think. I, I, I'm, I'm not totally in the loop, but I'm pretty sure this is like top three rare emotes right here. So, uh, yeah, it's not even a good emote, but yeah, cool to see it back. Then we also got this emote here. Also, I just got a notification on Twitter from Sheena BR. Apparently, this skin hasn't been back in 900 days so wow all right we got a pretty good shop here today but yeah pretty decent skin then we got hot wire i always thought this skin was pretty cool i just i, I never felt the urge to buy it but it does have some pretty dope effects going on but yeah cool stuff then we also got the pickaxe here it's a decent pickaxe 
Alright, so there were a few people over on Twitter that I selected for my 1v1 video and essentially we were going to 1v1 and if they beat me I would gift them, but our schedules just didn't quite line up and I felt bad for telling them they would be in a video and then being like, oh sorry, I got enough footage already. So I told them that I would gift them anyway. So the first guy here, he wants to be gifted the double agent pack. And then there's another guy who also wants the double agent pack. There he is. Boom. And also the shop just reset, so there's a lot of stuff in here I gotta buy. Which means I need more V-Bucks. Apparently Red Streak was last seen 1140 days ago. There it is. I don't know if it's just me, but it kinda looks like it's glowing. We have pretty clean pickaxe. We also got Moth Mando over here. Decent skin. So we got the new Goat Simulator skin. It's definitely a good meme skin. Other than that, don't think I'll rock this skin too much, but 1200 is definitely pretty good price. Pretty good price. We also got the Dino Guard bundle here. And then scrolling down, we got Shade. Ooh, okay. I, I actually haven't seen this edit style, but I really like that. Yeah, cool skin. Then we got this Clutch Axe here. Yeah, it's pretty dope. I definitely use that pickaxe if I was running Shade. And then we got the Chapter 2 defaults. I am not really as excited for these as I was the Chapter 1 defaults. I don't know why. But yeah, I guess it's still cool to see these, you know? So yeah, you already know. I'm gonna buy all of these. You know, not much to go over. I think we all know these skins well enough by now. And of course, the pickaxe. Yeah, I actually really like this default pickaxe. It was super clean. I mean, I guess it still is. Yeah, 500 for that. We also got the glider here. Eh, I, th this I could go without. I, I, I was never a fan of the, the open wing style gliders, but of course I'm gonna buy it anyway. Alright, so there's another guy who's gonna 1v1 and I just told him I'd gift him because we didn't end up 1v1ing. And he wants the Poise Playmaker, so I'm gonna go ahead and gift that to him. And then my friend reached tier 100, but he doesn't actually have the Battle Pass and I feel kind of bad, so I told him I'd gift it to him. Alright, we actually got a pretty decent shop today. It's just got a bunch of rare shit here that hasn't been back in over a year. So first off, we got the die cast here. Definitely a good skin, in my opinion. Then we also got this star cross glider. I don't remember this, honestly, but it does look pretty cool. I like that. Then we got the busy emote. That's a super nice wrap. Yeah, it's got subtle animations too. I like that. That's a good wrap right there. Then we got this wild accent pickaxe. It's actually really clean. I like that. The device music pack. Damn, the shop's about to reset. I don't even have time to buy anything. Rebel, I, I honestly, I don't like this skin. I actually, I dislike it. I never liked that skin. Why are you bullying me? Wingtip, pretty, pretty nice. Uh, Synapse, it's a pretty clean skin. It's got a second style here too. And then we got On The Hook. It's an all right emote. I, it should probably be 200 V-Bucks, but it also did come out years ago. So not gonna complain about the price there. Intensity is a classic. And then I think, yeah, that's all the rare stuff. Then we just got these, which I, I already, I have one of them. I didn't really want to buy any more because I, I never used this skin, but you know, I'm buying everything in the game now. I got to buy more V-Bucks So, All right, kind of cutting it close here. So the Slumberjack here, I, I mean, all these skins are the same. I think, I, yeah, I think they all just have these same three styles here and then option to take off the mask. Um, they're okay skins in my opinion. Not particularly my style, but I don't hate them. We got Sea Wolf. 
it's it's just a pirate. There's nothing else to it. Say, we we also got this back bling. That's that's literally two different back blings. Actually, really good for the price here. I do like this skin. Then we got the lead swinger. That's really good for the price, actually. I mean, there's a lot of detail on here. You got like stickers, the uh, scarf, you know, the actual aux cable. I, I, that's that's a really good pickaxe for the price, in my opinion. And then we got the sweaty emote. And then coming down here, we have more wraps. Wow, okay. Earlier in the video, I was talking about how maybe I was close to owning all the wraps now. I guess I was wrong. I, I honestly don't know where all these wraps came from. I don't remember any of these, but these all look super dope. So first off, we got the burning glow here. That looks super nice. That is very mesmerizing to look at. That is a really good wrap. And then we got the Galactic Spiral. That's super cool, too. Also got the Danger Donut here. It's, you know, just a donut. I, I, well, what else could he ask for for 300 V-Bucks? Really good. All right, I hate to back out on my word, but I'm just, I'm, I'm not gonna, I'm gonna save this for another day. I mean, I know these skins will be back. I will buy them eventually, but right now I want to save my money to do some giveaways or stuff like that at the start of the chapter. I, I don't, I don't want to waste V-Bucks on these skins because I know I'm not going to equip them. So I have one, one of the female ones. I guess I'll buy one of the male ones, but I, I don't see any reason to buy any more beyond that right now. I think I'll go with the wrap trapper here. And then I'll also buy the gear bundle here. All right, this shop here only has two things that I don't own. It's the Scrap Knight Jewels. This skin is so good. I, I can't believe it's only 1,200. And then the other thing here is this Crossroads pickaxe. And then aside from that, there's two other people that I was going to 1v1, but I just told them I'd gift them. So the first guy here wants to get the crack shot bundle here. And then the last guy here just wants the goat skin. We got this new Fortnite football club bundle, and uh, I was watching I Talk Fortnite's video, and he's absolutely right. This has to be the most random collab we've ever gotten. This, like, this is some shit straight out of a Ghost and Ninja thumbnail. New LeBron James World Cup edit style. It just doesn't make sense. That being said, you do get five super customizable skins for 3,000 V-Bucks, so... Then down here, we got the Mecha Team Leader Bundle, which only has this glider that I don't have. I could get it for 100 V-Bucks, so... And then down here, we got Brawler. After that, we got this emote here, which I can't hear because I have copyrighted audio off. But, you know, I'm gonna buy it anyway. And then we got the Page Turner emote. Alright, so my friend Noah wants the battle pass. He's pretty close to finishing it and the season's almost over. So I told him I'd gift it to him. Thank you, Seven. I really appreciate that. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, here it is. The final stuff I'm going to be buying of the chapter. Literally all we have here is the Dio skin. And then we also got the Llama Conga emote. I actually really like this emote. And then the last thing I'm going to be buying is the rest of the levels because I, I played a lot today, but I just I don't feel like playing anymore. So here we go. Alright guys, I actually lied in that last clip. This is going to be the last thing I'm buying of the chapter. My friend Noah here is pretty close to finishing the battle pass, but we're kind of on a time crunch here because the season ends in like two hours. I'm going to give this level up quest pack to him so that he could get the levels fast enough.